Okay, to test this, I have I'm logged into ADFS server. I don't have a client machine yet, so just to test it, I log in as a user called IT Manager. So if I say who am I? It's an IT manager. So let Let's launch a browser. I'm running Microsoft Chrome and I can say office.com and Office 365 sign in. I will say IT manager at itsense.net. And see, it's taking you to our organization sign in page. And this is fs.itsense.net page. It brings me to my ADFS server via web application proxy server which is running in my dmc and web application proxy it's passing the request to my adfs server which is running on my internal network and it's asking for my password so i provide what the password is say sign in and once it's got the authentication see Microsoft verified my credentials. Oh, sorry. ADFS server verified my credential. Pass security token to Office 365. Give a thumbs up. Yes, this is the valid user providing the right credentials. And I'm able to log in to Office 365 successfully. So this was a test of getting authenticated against active directory federation services when using office 365 or exchange online again adfs or active directory federation services is a good uh, i would say uh, it's a very is a secure way to manage authentication against your on-prem AD because at the end it's your on-prem AD it's authenticating it and you don't have to synchronize user passwords anymore uh, yeah you ideally need to have high available environment like ideally one or more load balancer that will be balancing load balancing against two or more web application proxy servers and those web application proxy servers will be connecting to your active directory federation services farm which will have two or more adfs servers but as it's a lab environment i have a single web application proxy and a single adfs server so this is it guys, uh, that's how you set up Active Directory Federation services for to have single sign-on with Office 365. I would like to sign off here and say please do subscribe to my channel, give me a thumbs up and take it easy and I will see you in next tutorial.